How's it going guys? It's the Apex Warrior here, and I'm back on RuneScape 3, and this is episode 21. Now, in the last video, um, I was, you know, talking about the armor, the armor dial convoys, and, you know, how they're really great experience, as I've, you know, found out. Um, they give you good constitution XP, good divination XP, and, I mean, it, it, it's a great way to get more renown, and, yeah. So... Also, what I said in the last video I said um I would be training my defense and um I'm here in uh, Edgeville um the I don't know what this I don't know what you call this place hold on let me just kill this guy very quickly there we go okay so if I go to my world map here uh hold on I just got done with combat so it's gonna take a little while let's wait for it okay Edgeville Monastery I had a feeling that that's um that's uh whoa what it was called my bad i was looking at this little demon looking thing up here but anyways yes um i've been training here i must have um i woke up at around five and not, not i didn't walk i didn't wake up around five i stayed up until like five in the morning um training on this going to the armadile um convoys and um yeah i've been getting a lot um a lot of renown for this so, um, hopefully in this episode, um, I'm going to level up maybe one more time. It depends on how far away I am from leveling up. So, I'll try to level up once, and, um, I'll go to the, um, armored dial, um, the tower, and I'll try to buy myself a huge XP lamp. If, uh, if, if it's like 40,000, I don't know, because right now I have around 76,000, um, XP. No, oh, XP. Um, 76,000 right now. So yeah, uh, I don't know, I might buy the huge XP lamp, if, if it costs a lot, then I won't, but, um, yeah, so, if, if it does cost a lot, um, I might, if I do buy it, then, um, later on in the episode, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to follow a lot of army dial and convoys, get a lot of, um, renown for that, and hopefully, I don't think my renown has, um, reset, I think I can only do, like, maybe 10,000 more. Which, that's alright, I mean, um, it just means I've been doing a lot of work for, um, for Amad for Amadil. So, yeah. What I've come to realize is that monks give you pretty good XP. Um, oh, don't, he's a person, he's a person. Um, um, th the spawn rates on the monks are pretty good. If you're playing on a high populated world, they're spawn fast. But I mean, heck, I've I've played on like low populated, like a hundred, like two hundred people, um, on once on um one world, and they still they still spawn pretty fast. But they give you forty eight XP and um, like my defense, I was I was level twenty and um now I'm level twenty seven and I only stood him here for about an hour, so it, it's it's good XP. I'm probably gonna do I might. They're good for defense. I don't know if they're good for strength. I'm not gonna do my attack since it's already thirty, and I'm I'm killing them pretty easily. So um, I'm not gonna get that much uh de um defense e XP at least I don't think. So hopefully we'll kill this one last guy and then I'll teleport to Falador and I'll go to the tower, see uh, how much that lamp costs. So hopefully this guy will make us level up. Uh, no, I think I need to kill one more. Is that a monk right there? No. Uh, okay. Let's quickly kill this one guy. And I'm pro- Um, I was looking at some training guides over YouTube and, um, the RuneScape Wiki, and, um... Oh, combat level 60! Yay! Come, uh, okay, so, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, did I unlock anything? I don't think I did. Just... Icantor's boots. Okay, so um, let's go to home. Uh, where's Valid? Right here. Sooner or later, I'm gonna activate all those um uh what uh those stones, Te teleport stones. I don't know what they're called. Um, lodge stones. I think that's what it's called. On L lodestone. Oh, I was close. Um, I'll try to um. Um, activate all of them, so I can, I can just easily teleport, like, halfway across the world, and that would be really, really fun. Okay, so what was I gonna do? Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go to the tower, on, and after that, I'm gonna get some more, uh, renown. 
So yeah, uh, yeah. Last night was an easy was an easy night for the army dealing um convoys because no one attacked. I mean there, a few godless uh, godless ambusher ambushers um attacked us, but that's really it. I mean, uh, oh seventy thousand. So I have I can only do fourteen thousand six hundred eighty more. So yep. Um, hold on, guys. I have to check some. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm sorry about that. Um, I had to check on something, but um, I am back on the tower. So let's um claim rewards for this um quartermaster. Uh, let's go to experience. So oh, it's only twenty five thousand. So that's pretty good. So I'm gonna buy one. Can I? I should want to claim this reward. Confirm. Okay, it looks like I got it, but it's I still have seventy nine thousand. Is it gonna go away? It looks like I still have it. That's uh, that's weird. I don't know. Well, I'm not gonna take any chances. Uh, I'm just gonna do it. So, what skill should I use? Uh, I don't wanna, I don't wanna do my fishing because I wanna do that all. You know, like I wanna go to the fishing guild and all that. I could do my divination, but that's pretty easy. Attack, defense, and strength seems to be my my most um hard. My more harder. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if I'm using correct language there. Grammar. My bad. Um, I guess we'll pick. A t I don't know. I guess I'm gonna pick attack on this. Confirm. Let's see how much. Uh, four thousand. Wow. So much for huge XP lamp. Okay. Oh, I mean, I went up two levels. That's pretty good. Um. So yeah, I, I yeah, that's pretty good. I mean. It's not the best. I probably should have done it on a, on a low skill so I can get up and you know. Yeah, I'll pro I'll probably buy another one, but not nah, like later. So I don't know. See that that's what that's what bothers me. I want to buy another one, but like like I said, it costs twenty five thousand, and I only have seventy nine thousand current renown. Oh, oh, current renown is fifty four thousand. Your total score is seventy nine thousand. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, so <laughs> it's all been cleared up. I've used it, just my total score and all that. Um is um yeah, like that. So oh while I'm at it, um if y'all if y'all watch my previous videos, like the two videos before this, um I get sacred sacred metal fragments um from from those building sites. And um I was following in a convoy and I got this a Vinci shield co component, and if I click on it, this will create a whatever shield cosmetic override at the cost of 1,000 sacred metal fragments. Now I do have around 500. I don't know if the shield is good, but um, if it costs that much, because I've seen a lot of people like, is this guy wearing it? No, um, but I hear it's actually pretty good. So hopefully, um, I'll get that. Let's let's go to my bank very quickly. Let's see what I um have. I have five hundred and twenty. So I'm I'm just gonna keep these sacred metal of. I'm just gonna keep these fragments here, and hopefully, um, in the chat it says a ben a Bandogian convoy has spawned at the Central Falador site, and that's actually pretty. I mean, that's just right up here. I don't know if I should attack it or not. Since I'm all by myself, there really is nothing. Um, here it is. Ah, uh, um. Well, I would like to. Uh, can I follow this? I'm gonna follow it. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do it. I'm. I'm not gonna commit suicide there. Huh. Well, I already. Oh, it spawned at the Lumbridge site. So, where's the Armadillo and convoy? Okay, so I'm gonna spawn at Draenor. Drain war. Um, let's quickly teleport. Let's quickly follow it because I want to get some um, more renown and all that. So yeah, let's. Um, it, it, if you looked at the map, it seemed all of them were converging. Um, like they were all. Oh, that's actually, that's that's gonna be pretty good if that happens. Okay, so where am I? Um, on the map. So I'm right here. I'm in the convoys right up there. So I need to quickly run all, all the way over here. Uh, it, where is it? Should be like right over here. I don't say it, guys. 
the heck? Oh, where is it? Hold on, let's... Oh, it's all the way up there. Dang! Oh, there it is. There it is. Is that it? Follow. Follow. Oh, it looks like it looks like it looks like we're getting under attack. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly engage these guys, heal them. Oh, it looks like it's moving, so I'm gonna um just follow it and um, wait until these um divine seekers. I think that's what they're called, Armadale and a diviner. I was way off on that. I'm gonna wait. Um. Um. I'm gonna wait until they say seeking divine energy, and then um I will. Collect the divine energy, and I will get a lot of renown. Since I'm like, I'm one of the only guys here. I think there's another person following this convoy. I don't know. I I don't see him. Yeah, the, yeah, right there. Like right there. Yeah. Oh, there's two people. Okay. Well, uh, I think this is going to Verok. I'm pretty sure it looks like it is. It might not. It might go to. Uh, yeah, I'm. Pr I think it's going to the Verok. Um. I think it's going to the Ver Verok building site. Yeah, right over here. You see right there. I I don't think I think y'all can see my my mouse so yeah pretty sure y'all can and here we are um we are safe uh no one attacked us we have some backup right over here so that's good I think they're gonna say sinking divine energy yeah they're setting up shop here so hopefully I can um get some more um divination experience and um get more renown so let's um I'm gonna close out of this okay there we go. Let's wait until uh oh, Banonijin. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, heal this guy, get some more Constitution XP. Um, I'll wait until this guy dies, then I'll get some Divine Energy. Looks like he's he's almost dead. Um, no no he he ran away he ran away. Okay, what? Well, uh, looks like yeah, looks like they didn't do anything. Oh yeah, he did. Yeah, we we successfully killed that uh little um. Bandonesian guy. I was I was trying to come up scum. There we go. <laughs> um, but yeah, the thing the thing I like about um these convoys is it's so peaceful. <laughs> You're just going through the woods and you know um I, I I like like when they're traveling outside cities and you know it's daytime and all that. Unlike Draenor when it's like completely dark and spooky. I don't like it when it's there, but you know you get good experience. You get uh, you get more renown, and more renown, um, means, um, more access to stuff, gear, um, abilities, abilities, and more, what else am I looking for? Um, abilities, and XP lamps, there we go. <laughs> um, oh, we still have a Bandonesian guy try, trying to attack. I would attack him, but I can't, um... Since I'm such a low level. Oh, come on. Kill him, guys. Don't let this guy die on us. Oh, he's almost dead. He's almost dead. Oh, no, he died. Um, our guard died. But, um, that's alright. Um, that's alright. Um, we still killed him. He deserved, he deserved to die. Okay, so I'm gonna harvest this. And, um, yeah, so if y'all, if I didn't know, um, what this whole arm, army deal and bandos thing is, it's just a big, um, god, god war, like part two, kind of, and you, basically, you just get divination, um, you follow these con convoys, and you get divination, and then you have to safe, um, safely, right now, we're in a safe location, so once we fill this up, and, um, we get, like, however much stuff, like, we might get a million points or something like that. And you get a good experience and all that, and the person with more divination will more likely win the war. See, Bandos only has four, fourteen point seven million. We have twenty three point nine million, and that and that's going to increase just because of this. So, um, basically, you just want to save your convoys. You want to guide them and um, make sure they don't make sure um, you know ambushers can't successfully um, destroy them. You have to protect them, get divination, and um, yeah. And hold on, so, okay, so, did we get anything? Well, it looks like the thing didn't increase, but, um, it's, but, yeah. Um, I got 80,000 renown for that, that's pretty good. I think it went up by a thousand, um, <laughs> I thought it was going to win up by a million, my bad. 
But it says the Armadillo Commonwealth has returned to its faction camp with a full load of divine energy. So that's good. The more we do that, um, the more, um, the more renown we can get and the more score we can get. And it says Ar Armadillo, Armadillo, my bad, leads by 9,187,074. So that's good. We have a pretty decent lead on them. So if we keep on getting this lead on them, then we will win the war. Um, and yeah, but I I I, I hope this war never ends because it's it's just so cool. Cause I mean, there's just a lot of fights going on. It's PVP is on like every world now if you turn it on, and I think PVP is on on mine. But um, hold on, broadcast, clan chat, friend chat, uh, oh, trade and assistance maybe. Well, I don't know. But anyways, guys, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I might post one like very late tonight just because I love RuneScape so much. Or maybe early tomorrow. But hey guys, that's the end of the video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If if you would leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Well, that is it guys, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.